What's up guys, this is Barman2205 and welcome to Pokemon Card GB2 Here Comes Team GR, I think is the proper name of this game. But basically, this is Pokemon Card Game for the Game Boy number 2. This is the sequel. It never released outside of Japan, which is very exciting. Uh, this is an English fan translation that I have acquired through methods that I do not wish to disclose for the camera. Uh, and we're gonna we're gonna play it right now. Um, the uh, the big difference this time around. You know what I'm gonna do super professionally um, in front of the camera is turn my phone on silent. I just I felt it in my pocket and was like, ooh, wow, what a great start to the video this is. Anyway, also look at look at my hair. My hair is just. Oh my, oh my. Anyway, let's start a new game. So the big difference is obviously picking a boy or a girl. Um, we're actually, as much as I like playing as girls, um, I like, I like girls. Um, we're gonna play as the boy, because this is meant to be a direct follow-up, and we are playing, you know, a direct sequel to the things that we did last time. I'm so professional, you guys. What is our name? Our name is... Oh, no. Haha, -ha, this bit is not translated, unfortunately. Um, oh, there we go. Oh, whew. That was... That was... That, that's good. Uh, we are going to be... Oh, what was what was our name before? Oh, you know what? It was Bro. Uh, I don't think the um. Yes, it is Bro level sixty nine. <laughs> Woo! Is this okay? Yes. Um. So the big difference uh, with this one is that it's got all the same cards that the old one had. Uh, it also features the Team Rocket expansion, which released afterwards, which I'm somewhat familiar with. And then it has, like, 200 other cards that were never released outside of Japan, which I am not so familiar with. Uh, so this series is going to be a lot less of me acting like I know what I'm talking about, even though I don't. Uh, it is going to be a lot more of me just figuring out which cards are good. Um, and there will be less... Uh, of me trying to showcase like competent decks and more just me playing and we'll we'll build what we can out of what we have and we're just we're just gonna have a good time uh bro level 69 loves collecting pokemon cards bro level 69 came to this island seeking the legendary pokemon cards eight club masters guarded the way to the grand masters and the four grand masters protected the legendary cards after many duels bro level 69 beat the grand masters the four legendary cards were finally inherited by a new master duelist then one day, something terrible happened. A blimp! It's abducting all of the cards! Oh no! Hey there, blimpy boy. A mysterious group suddenly attacked. They called themselves Team Great Rocket, or Team Grr. Team Grr attacked the island's card clubs and stole all of their cards! Oh no! Bro level 69 is losing all of his cards! All of my 37 Nidorinos! <laughs> or Nidorinos! <laughs> They're all gone! I must collect them all again. Uh okay, this is this is this is taking its sweet time. Alright, even Bro level 69's cards were stolen. You must notify Dr. Mason about these Pokemon card thieves! Let's go to Dr. Mason's lab immediately. Alright. Mason Laboratory. Whoa, if it isn't Bro level 69! Oh, it's Ronald! Oh my god, Ronald, I hate this guy. Remember me? I'm your longtime rival, Ronald! What a clown. Bro level 69, do you have any Pokemon cards on you? Oh, Team Great Rocket stole them. I'd better check them out to stay one step ahead of you. By the way, I think Dr. Mason wants to speak with you. Well then, see ya, Bro level 69! 
Oh, thank heavens, you're safe. Did he have a voice before? I don't remember. You're safe, bro level 69. It's awful, a group called Team Great Rocket or Team Grr invaded. This island's card clubs were attacked one by one. Everybody's cards were stolen and many club members were kidnapped. Team Grr stole the legendary Pokemon cards from the Grandmasters too. Please help us get the cards back from those villains. Wouldn't I have the legendary Pokemon cards because I won them last time? Yeah, we'll accept his request. Since they took your cards, you'll need a replacement deck. That way, you can use your deck to battle with others. Here, take this deck. Luckily, it wasn't stolen by Team Grr. You've received a starter deck. You can have this mini computer as well. A minicom. That mini computer is a handy tool that helps organize your cards. It can list your card collection, check mail, and even record decks. All recorded decks are sent to our lab's deck record machines too. I'm counting on you to get everyone's cards back, bro level 69. Cool, um... Right, let's check our deck then. Let's view the old starter deck. Alright, Charmander, Charmeleon, Growlithe, and Ponyta. And these, these are like the base set ones, aren't they? Yes, they are. Oh, you're not! Who are you? Charge for 20. Flip a coin of tails, this attack does nothing. Ember, discard one energy in order to use this. That's pretty meh. Uh, you are... The old... I remember... I had a lot of luck with Ponyta before... Before things got started. Alright, you're the base set Diglett. And the base set Machop and Machoke. No Machamp! Uh, base set Rattata, base set Raticate. You're a new Spearow, who are you? Peck, just one for ten, cool. And a Meowth, you're new as well. Bite for ten. And Fury Swipes, three coins, ten for each, two colors, okay. All right, trainers, what have we got in the trainers? One energy retrieval, Two potions, one gust of wind, two switch, one bill. Oi, yoy, yoy! Fire energy, fighting energy. Alright, well, we must start our collection again. <laughs> um, I'm also gonna go into the options. Get, let's, yeah, let's speed up this text, boy. We'll show the animations, we'll show the coin toss, window color. Ooh! I'm gonna go with blue. For my squirtly boy, for my blast, for the rain dance! Remember the rain dance? What's Minicom? Deck record machine link, view mailbox. You have no new mail. Uh, view card catalog. Oh, so this just shows all of my cards. Oh, that's cool. Um, shut down. Coins. Oh, yeah, you can change your coins in this one. Like, you get new coins. Um, which is kind of cool. Uh, alrighty. You must find all the members of Team Gear. Ronald and the others need your help. Search all of the clubs. The room to the right holds the labs, computers, and deck machines. These include our deck records. Dr. Mason created for players. You ought to try it at least once. We're not going to do any tutorials, because we know how to play. If you watched the last series, you know the rules. And if you didn't, yeah, you'll, you'll catch up quick, I guess. When you have all the cards to make a deck, all the opponents, blah de blah de blah. Hey, bro, level 69. There's a device, a deck record machine. Cool. Did you know Dr. Mason invented the automatic deck machine? I I did. Apparently, oh yeah, I forgot I can run, can't I? If you'd like to save your game, press the start button. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Long time no see, it's me, Tech Sam. Have a practice tool? No. Um, so here's the tutorial guy. He tells us about booster packs. All right. Bro level 69, wait. What? Be careful, Team Guru is strong. Are you sure you know the rules? You can learn the basics from Sam at the table to your left. For more advanced information, visit Aaron in our training room. Nah, I'm good. I know how to play this game. Um. Okay, well. Let's just go to the fighting club, I guess? I don't actually know where to go. Yo, if it isn't bro level 69! It's more serious than I thought. Every club has been burgled. Team Guru doesn't seem to be in this particular club at the moment. 
I've heard that there's been a sighting at the Rock Club though. Anyway, I barely have any cards to deal with as it is. Say, why don't we card pop to get some new cards? You are using card pop? Oh, are you using card pop with all of your friends? And press the A button. You got an Oddish! Cool! Oh, that's the jungle Oddish. Okay. Um, typical, typical stuff. Now to save my data. In any case, Team Gur isn't here. Bro level 69, let's go check out the Rock Club. I'll visit the other clubs and gather information about Team Gur. Later, bro. L level 69. Uh, Alright, so the Rock Club. That's where we're going. Hey, everybody. Hat Kid! Since Team Gur took everyone's cards, no one can play cards anymore. It's so boring now. <laughs> we, we could all just go home and do other things with our lives, but why would we do that? Why, hello, little dear! Do you know anything about Imakuni? Yeah, he played that weird deck. He tends to wander aimlessly from club to club. If you find him, challenge him to a duel. You may learn something. Like how to be bad at the game. I'm so embarrassed! Team Gur has taken all of my cards. They're supposedly here right now, fighting the Clubmaster Gene! Yeah, this is a big problem. Girl, snore, snore, Snorlax. I love Snorlax. Hey, do you have a Snorlax level 20? If you do, may I have it? I'll gladly trade you my rare Jigglypuff level 12 for it. I don't have one. Sorry, girl. Welcome to the gift center. And the battle center. Wait, what? You may win booster packs here for participating in duels with friends. You'll win three booster packs for a victory. Well, you can just grind packs by playing with actual other players. That's cool. I mean, I can't do that because I'm just playing by myself. But that's cool that that's a feature. Guru number one. Look at that. Gene, it seems you're about to lose. This place will soon be under the control of Team Gur. <laughs> but you see, I'm Gene. I'll show you why they call me the Rock Club Master. Save yourself the trouble. Fall to your knees and respect me, Gur number one. <laughs> respect to me, Gur number one. That's even his name. Ah, but you're so inexperienced. I won't do anything of the sort. Gah, impossible. That I, Gur number one of Team Great Rocket, would lose. Chia. So it seems I failed to capture the Rock Club. It figures that the Rock Club's the only one good at defense. Rock Club Master Gene, I may be retreating today, but be warned. I'll return and beat you to a pulp. You're Bro Level 69, the people of Dr. Mason, aren't you? I see. Bro Level 69, Team Gur has been attacking the eight clubs on this island recently. But I, Gene, have defended the Rock Club like a hardened stone. The other clubs, though, seem to have been taken over. I know you had the power to defeat the Grand Masters once before. Please, help all the other clubs by taking down Team Gur. I'm Ryan, a sculptor, a member of the Rock Club. Would you like to do it? Yes, let's, let's play... Let's play an actual game, shall we? That's what we're here for. Only took 13 and a half minutes to get into an actual game of Pokemon cards. Let's see how terrible this deck is. Choose a basic Pokemon to place in the arena. Um... Well, ooh, actually, yeah, let's go Charmander, because we can evolve him into the Charmeleon. Ah, oh, the music's back! Do, 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 do. Let's bench Ponyta and Growlithe. Do, 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 do. Aw, alright. It's a sand tree. Oh, because he, he opens with Bill. He plays Pot of Greed on his first turn. So this follows the same broken rules that the first game did. Uh, they can attack on the first turn. Um, there's no, like, restrictions on trainer cards. Uh, it's just a Rick rollicking good time. Um, what do you what do you do again? Scratch, Ember. Yeah, it's alright. Um... Wow. What a great start. Put Cubone on the bench. Energy removal? 
you smell. You smell like doo doo. Okay, we drew a switch. Do we even bother switching? I could try switch to Growlithe. Um. Because it's not like we can attack anyway. Uh, alright, let's. Let's play the switch. Let's send out Growlithe. Let's see how the boy does. What a great start. What a great start to this playthrough. We, we haven't even hit him once yet. <laughs> Put these energies on Ponyta. Okay. <laughs> I, this is this is so bad. This is so bad. I haven't even hit this Sandrew once. Okay, we've lost Growlithe. <laughs> go, Ponyta, go! I'm actually gonna put that on Ponyta. We're gonna- we're just gonna flame tail. Just hit it! Just hit it for 30. Get it out of here. I'm very tired of the Sandshrew. I'm very, very tired. Um, let's put that on Charmander, I guess. Let's bench this Charmander, or else we're gonna lose pretty soon. Alright, come on. Thank you! Okay. Whoa, that was a cool little animation. That was new. Another Ponyta. Cubone is on the bench. Rage. 10 plus 10 more for each damage counter. Oh god, okay. I don't think I have plus power in this deck, do I? I have Switch. Uh, okay, so either way it's gonna kill me next turn. So let's just hit it as hard as we can. Down it goes. Um, oh no, we can't attack with this Charmeleon. Energy retrieval. Uh, discard one other card up to two basic energies. Let's do that. Let's discard Rattata because it sucks. Let's get these two fire energies back. Uh. Ah. <laughs> I don't actually want to lose this thing straight away, so let's also play Switch. Switch for that, Charmander. Um, let's also bench Ponyta. And we're done! Okay. Because you're gonna hit the Charmander for 40 now. Dugdrio has a Pokemon power, we should probably check what that is. This is not going remotely well. Um, Pokemon power, go on- yeah, see, you're one of the new ones. As long as Dugtrio was on the bench, prevent all damage done by attacks to Tugtrio. Okay, that's fine. I'm not doing any bench stuff anyway. Okay. Guess we'll put a Ch 
Machop on the bench. Uh, what does Machop do again? One energy for 20. That's not terrible. Um, Alright, Charmander's gonna die. <laughs> He's gonna claim his third prize card. And then Charmeleon just needs to win us the game. <laughs> It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Uh, let me just check. What does Flamethrower do? Just guard one fire energy. Okay. Let's stick with Slash for now. Another fire energy. Okay. Gravel. Oh lordy lordy. Choose up to two of your opponent's bench Pokemon. This attack does 10 damage to each of them. And this hits for 30. Oh no! Because we can't... We can't kill this thing this turn. So... Okay, so we lose. Um, I'm gonna go down swinging anyway. Sadly, not enough, though. It's not enough! It's not enough! <laughs> Hang on, let me just do that. There we go. I'm a little slightly more facing the camera now. We lost the duel with Ryan because our cards are bad. <laughs> Alright, how about... Andrew. Let's let's try Andrew. <laughs> Maybe the problem is that we're in the rock club with a deck that's like half fire types. Uh, I'm gonna try a different tactic this time. We're gonna lead with Ponyta, because Ponyta can kind of get off the bench a little faster with, with attacks. Okay, he's got nothing on the bench. We're going second again, that's lame. Rhyhorn, Rhyhorn, why are you so big? Oh my god. More of this coin flip nonsense. At least he didn't pull it off. Um, I have a lot of Charmeleons. Double call it synergy to Rhyhorn. No, don't do that, you... Oh my goodness. kick. And we're gonna die. And I have no energy cards now. <laughs> like, I have, I have no energy cards. <laughs> uh... <laughs> He's got a Kangaskhan. Okay, so we've lost this game already. I wish they had added a forfeit button to this game. That's... That's what was needed, is a, a forfeit button. Yep, this is... this is not looking good for me. <laughs> Um... Nope! <laughs> Prehistoric Dream. Once during your turn, before your attacks, you may flip a coin if heads all damage done by a Pokémon that have evolved from a mysterious fossil will do an additional 10 damage when they attack. Dang, that's cool! 
That means it's actually worth playing like mysterious fossil cards. Hey, an energy! I'm basically, I'm, I'm just throwing this game at this point. Like, I'm not actually expecting to win. Alright, that's his third prize card. Let's go with Meowth. I'm a chop. We're done. We have no energies. Yep, okay, there's there's a third dude here. <laughs> Let's try the third dude. I'm Matthew. Despite what it looked like, Team Guru never got close to conquering us, though I had been defeated by that Guru fellow. Okay, Matthew is garbage at this game. Surely we can defeat even Matthew. Please. Please. Okay, let's go with... Growlithe can attack for just one energy. He's also actually the only basic Pokemon we drew, so that's... That's a thing. So now I have the opposite problem. Good god, why? We've got the opposite problem this time. Where now we've got nothing but energies. Uh, we can't play any of our other cards. Okay, well at least I got that going. Tackle. There's a Diglet. Let's bench the Diglet. Let's actually check what the Diglet does. Let's... Uh, okay. Um, I'm actually going to put a Fire Energy on Growlithe. And then we're going to use Ember for 30. There's a Charmeleon that we can't play. Dig. Okay, I'm actually going to play another Fire Energy. And Ember again. We can one-shot this Diglett. We are actually in the lead, which is astonishing. Four Fire Energies. <gasps> yes! Oh, he had nothing on the bench! He had nothing on the bench! Yes! Oh my goodness. Matthew, you suck. Okay. A premier booster pack. So the booster packs are all different in this game. Uh, ooh. I'll take a Snorlax. Sure. This is the one that I think it is. Yeah, this is the jungle Snorlax. Thick skin, can't be confused, paralyzed, poison, blah, 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 blah. And body slam. Uh, wait, flip a coin if heads. But yeah, it's four energies though, which is a lot. Charmeleon, we've seen. Pokedex. Look at the top five, rearrange them. Meh. Uh, Jinx, you're a new Jinx. Pound, one colorless for ten. A psychic and colorless is double slap, twenty for each heads. Okay. Meowth, we've already got you. Venonat, you're new. Disable, flip a coin. If heads choose one of the defending Pokemon's attacks, that Pokemon can't use that attack during your opponent's next turn. Interesting. Psybeam, flip a coin if heads the defending Pokemon's not fused. Drowsy. You're just the normal last Drowsy, aren't you? Yeah, I remember you. Eevee, you were in the last one too, yeah, because you're from Jungle. Another Switch, another Fighting Energy. Oh, we on they only give out one pack this time? Boo! Alright, uh, what are we going? We've gone for almost half an hour. You know what? Let's try one of these guys again. Let's try Ryan again. Actually, can we, can we fight Gene? I made a deck that's... Yes! <laughs> let's, let's defeat Gene. <laughs> this 
This is not going to go well at all. Um, let's go with... Actually, wait. Okay, we've got, we've got no energy again. Let's go with... You know what? Let's go with Diglett. Even though he's terrible, he can attack with the one energy we have. Still, still haven't won the going first turn cost. But that's fine. Uh, if any Pokemon attacks, any damage is reduced by 20. Excellent! We can't even hit this thing. It's Bill. There's another energy, at least. Um, yeah. I'm actually going to put it in Ponyta. Rage. Gust of Wind? Who's you got on the bench? This Rhyhorn that can't do anything yet. This Geodude. Oh, with its stone barrage. You know what? Let's play a Gust of Wind. Let's send the Geodude out. Let's dig. Placed a big scary onyx on the bench. Another fighting energy. Okay. This isn't going terribly <laughs> so far oh, I forgot this is a six prize match isn't it oi, oi, oi. okay we can't retreat oh it doesn't matter because we're dead anyway all right let's send out the ponyta Biro. He does resist fighting. Ooh. He does resist fighting. Interesting. Spiro might be the go to guy here. <laughs> Of all things, <laughs> a Spiro. Rock Tomb, that's fine. I'm not planning on retreating, I'm not going anywhere, buddy. Let's put that on Spiro. Let's use a potion to keep Ponytar in the fight. Let's Flame Tail again. How worried am I about whatever he uses next? <laughs> Weird leg. It's so it's so good. I love it. Uh, okay, fire energy. Another fire energy. Um, what does Spiro need again? Just two colorless, and it can use its wing attack. Wing attack isn't that strong. It's the only thing I'm kind of about. 
Uh, oh, right. Um, either way, he's gonna knock out Rapidash, uh, Ponyta. So we may as well just hit it as hard as we can. Yep, there goes Ponyta. So he's taken two prize cards. I think we've taken two as well. There's, there's another pony tar. Oh, who are we gonna put this on? Let's put this on Growlithe, I think. Then we're gonna wing attack. this. Oh, I don't like this. Stone Barrage, until you get Tails, does 20 times the number of heads. Excellent! <laughs> Not to mention it resists it anyway, so... Wing attack. Oh yeah, yeah. This is gonna be painful. This is gonna be a slow match. Oh yes. Finally, the coin flips are going my way. Um, actually, who are we gonna put that fighting energy on? Let's put it on Growlithe. Okay, Graveler, if you could do nothing again, that would be fantastic. Energy Retrieval, that's okay. <laughs> the only downside is, because we killed it so slowly, he set a lot of other stuff up. Um, there's another Spearer, that's amazing. Um, Okay, two more to go. Marowak, this thing scares me. That thing scares me as well. If heads, the minimum can't attack. Oh, and it only hits for 10, so that's gonna do no damage because we resist it. Amazing. Let's get the next Spearow ready. I would love to hit this thing for more than 20 a turn. That's the only <laughs> the only problem with this Spearow. Oh no! That's okay. That's okay. Alright, well Spearow... Spearow number two is ready. I guess that's our turn. Oh, what's the retreat cost on Spiro actually? Because if it's free, we can get around the coin flip. Oh my god, if it's free. Surely it's not. Surely it's not. Oh my god, it's free. <laughs> so what we can do is... We can just retreat it for free for this Spiro, and this Spiro isn't affected by by the um, uh, isn't affected by the coin flip. So we can just keep dancing around it. That's that's hilarious. Do it again. I dare you. Do it again. I don't even care. I don't even care. We'll take no damage. This is this is hilarious. This 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 is this is the most beautiful 
<laughs> the most beautiful game of Pokemon I have ever seen. Do it again. Do it again. Go for it. Go for it. Oh no! I can't attack! Whatever will I do? Whatever will I do? <laughs> uh, well, first I'm gonna put this fighting energy on this Ponyta. Um, then... I guess we'll just retreat! For this Spearow! <laughs> That felt so dirty. Oh, okay. This thing kind of wall. Look at look at all that health. Whole. Okay, right on does twenty damage to itself. If your opponent has any benched Pokemon, he or she chooses one of them and switches it with the defending Pokemon. Do the damage before switching, even if right on is knocked out. Okay, so the twenty to itself is nice. We will resist some of this damage. Um, so let's sub the other Spearow in. Okay. Okay. This isn't the end of the world. So basically, it's now another three Spearow hits. I think we're only gonna get two in. No, we can get three in. We can get three in. Well, either way, we've got other Pokemon that can attack afterwards as well. So we are okay. on Charmander. Like, we've got other Pokemon ready to go. Yeah, so even if he knocks out one of the Spearow here... Oh, plus he's, he does 20 to himself. Oh, and he didn't attack... Yeah, because he doesn't want to do 20 to himself, so... Okay, and now we win. Well, that wasn't exactly a clean fight, but... <laughs> the end result is what matters. Um, don't even trip, dog. Don't even trip. <laughs> My number one KO deck. It should prove useful for dueling GR number one. You got the fighting coin. Cool. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll put that coin in. Why not? Your luck may change if you switch to... Switch out your coin for this coin. By all means, please use it in your duel against GR1. At the moment, GR1 seems to have retreated to the fighting club. Please, they're your only hope. Or you're their only hope. Okay, so we still need to beat these two kids. We will do that next time. Also, he didn't give me a pack. He did give me a deck, though. Um, what's this one? Oh! Grass types. This is, this is what we need. Good old Caterpie. Nidoran. Th there's my first Nidorino. My first Nidorino. And a couple of Tangela. And more Diglett. More of this Geodude. Graveler. Onyx, I remember you. Rhyhorn, yeah. Trainers, you've got two energy searches, one Professor Oak. Two switches and a Pokedex. But not Bill. Cool! Um, we're probably going to sort of mishmash all both of the decks together. And then we're going to try those guys again. But we're going to do that in the next episode. Um, for now... Ladies and gentlemen, that's going to do it for this first episode of Pokemon 
Uh, let's just call it Pokemon Card Game 2. <laughs> That's a much simpler name. Uh, thank you so much, guys. If you liked this video, give it a like so I know you liked it. Leave a comment, let me know what you thought, and subscribe to check out the rest of the playlist as it happens. Thank you so much, guys. Please keep it real. And keep it my man.